our all new C series with the CS100 and CS300, which bring all of the advantages of the new technology, bringing you better economics and a better environmental footprint from 100 seats all the way to 160 seats. Bombardier's C series airliners may be late in coming to market, but when they enter service, they're set to be better than promised. On the eve of the 2015 Paris Air Show, where the CS100 and CS300 are making their long-anticipated debuts, the manufacturer announced significant performance improvements. The big news is we beat the brochure. And uh, if you check the records, I don't think that's happened in the last 30 years that an all-new clean sheet design beat the brochure from what was announced uh, back when we launched the program to what we're going to deliver at EIS. And so some of the uh, key points of that, we are better on fuel burn, uh, we're more payload range, uh, 3,300 nautical miles, so that's 350 nautical miles uh, more than what we announced. And again, we also use heavier weights than our competitors, so it's uh, actually, but we're just comparing back to what we said. The maturity we see in reliability and flight test is also very, very encouraging, so uh, no, we're excited. Uh, teams are uh, working hard and uh, motivated, and we look forward to delivering to our first customer, Swiss, which, to be honest, they're absolutely the best positioned uh, partner, customer to, uh, to do it with us. Bombardier also claims that the C-Series jets are more environmentally friendly than current aircraft of comparable size. It says carbon dioxide emissions will be 20% less and nitrous oxide emissions 50% lower. The manufacturer also claims the noise footprint will be around one-third those of the current aircraft. Visitors to the show at Le Bourget Airport can see both C-Series aircraft on the static display with this being the first time anyone will have seen the cabin interiors of the new airliners. Bombardier says it is getting the delayed development back on track and will complete certification of the initial CS100 model at the end of 2016, with the CS300 to follow six months later. We're now uh, over 70% of the certification uh, tests and reports are uh, completed. The actual flight test program, we're 65% completed. And we're running uh, really on rate to finish our flight test program and certify as we had uh, publicly said the second half of this year. So uh, a lot of work going on, but uh, progress is uh, really strong. On the first day of the Paris Air Show, Lufthansa Group Airline, Swiss, upgraded its order for 10 CS100s to the larger CS300. It still has another 20 CS100s on order.